Bayelsa State Government has concessioned its aquaculture village to a private company. The Commissioner for Agriculture, Duday Week, and the Managing Director of the company are optimistic the state will move from a consumer status to being a producer in a project expected to engage thousands of youths in the state. Now, correspondent Vietime George has details. The Bayelsa Aquaculture Village in Yenegui was inaugurated on February the 17th, 2018, by former president Olusegun Obasanjo. The brainchild of Governor Syriaka Dixon, the Aquaculture Village has about 500 fish ponds to project the government's revolutionary agriculture policy. Tuesday, October the 30th, an agreement was reached for the aquaculture village to be concessioned to a private company. The state's responsibility in this regard is to build the farms, create the infrastructure, and allow private sector to drive them. Here we are, is to hand over the Bayasa Aquaculture Village, Nyenegwe, to a private sector to meet up with the strategic objectives of the restoration government in that cultural sector. Both parties speak on the importance of the project to the state economy and its significance to employment generation. On this partnership for, for, for the Yenegwe, we are expecting a minimum of 1,600 jobs for Yenegwe. And, for, you know, and then when you blow that up for other, other local governments, we'll be expecting a minimum of about 16,000 direct job creation in the, in the sector of agriculture. You know, let me say aquaculture precisely. Economic activities will be sprouting, therefore the state's economy will increase. And of course, the state will also therefore be positioned to be a producer instead of a consumer of agricultural produce. The aquaculture village in Yenegwe and the cassava starch factory in Ebedebri are testaments to the Seriaka Dixon administration's gradual push towards diversifying the state's economy beyond oil and gas. Ovietime George, TVC News, Yenagoa, Bayelso State.